What's up, folks? What's up, folks? BG Aloysius here. I here in the Philippines, man. And uh, I want to talk about this, man. And for years, it's been a few years, man. There's been this narrative that women in South America, Southeast Asia, in the islands of America, in uh, Eastern Europe, all of them are traditional. Um, not all of them, but they, that's what they promote. They're traditional, different than Western women. Of course, they are different than Western women because they're from a different place, so the culture is different. All right, but what I'm trying to tell you people out here is don't believe that all the women are traditional <laughs> and have traditional values. Best believe, I've been here in the Philippines for probably almost six months now. I date a Filipina, so she tells me the deal on what really goes on here. And just how Western women, some of the Western women want your money and use you for money and this and that, it goes the same way over here in Thailand and wherever else you dog going to go because women are women wherever you go. The Matrix has no borders. They have phones, internet, all right? They see what's going on, all right? These women will, will get pregnant on purpose. They will date you. Just to get out of their situation. Now, I'm not saying it's all of them. There are some good ones out there. But I'm letting you know. Stop falling for that false narrative that's been going on. All right? Uh, the red pill been pushing that. Um, the passport bros that's up to no good been pushing that same stuff and lying to you. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Shoot. My lady says it's hard to find a good woman, a real good woman, a genuine woman. You know? Why do you think a lot, a lot of females they get with older guys here? You know what I'm saying? They got their pension. Of course, yes, the money, uh, the, the dollar or wherever uh, goes further here. But that gets them out of their situation, all right? And, and, and you know, I heard, I hear the talk. Oh, uh, why don't you get with this person so you can get your situation or so you can go to America or she go to England or so you can go to Australia or New Zealand. Get out your situation. You know what I'm saying? You don't understand the mindset, but yet y'all follow every word that these people say online that's faking the funk. Y'all don't even hear all the horror stories of people getting took. They say don't bring your lady back to America. They can take you over here. There's plenty of people that took the woman to my uncle married to a Filipino. That's how I met my Filipina through my uh, my my aunt that's married to my uncle. He took her to America. They still together. So don't believe that narrative, man. You know what I'm saying? And and if you can't bring your woman. <laughs> to America while her leaving you, she wasn't a good woman. She was not a good woman. So I understand this narrative. It's a lie. It's a lie. Y'all need to stop teaching that and pushing that. Women are women. All right? Women are women no matter where you go. Just like men are men no matter where you go. Yeah, we have different cultures, but the, the bottom line is our fabric our fabric, the fabric of men is the fabric of men, and the fabric of women is the fabric of women. All right, sure. They may seem more traditional. It's traditional women in America. They just taken, and then y'all just promote the the uh, the women that think the way they think. You know what I'm saying? The women that 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 talk trash about the. Other about the uh, about the third world country or the country women, you know what I'm saying? The women that 
uh, got standards with the six feet tall. Now, that's the only type of women that y'all push, but y'all don't push the women that talk sense. Because if y'all do that, you know, how you gonna make money? Believe me, these people are telling you this stuff so they can make money. They, they, they putting sugar in your ear so you can take it in because they, they like what you're saying. Because they've been, they been not having a good time. They've been getting played. Or they ain't been getting women. And so that's why they push this narrative. All right? That's why they push stop believing <laughs> that. Again, the matrix has no borders. No borders at all. Like I said before, they have internet. You look on there, you can see doggone these... The, so-called poor women that y'all call them, um, <clears throat> twerking online, shaking their asses, shaking their hips, whipping and dipping, flipping and skipping. All right. <clears throat> y'all being pimped by your own content creators that y'all jockstrap ride for, man. It's not true what they say. There's good women all over the world. There's good women all over the world. There's also bad women all over the world. There's traditional women all over the world. And there's also modern-minded women all over the world. There's homeworkers all over the world. There's gold diggers all over the world. I even saw this one man, you know what they say, of course I'm this. I just seen one man say, of course I'm a, uh, yes, I'm a Filipino. Of course I'm a gold digger. Come on, man. Like, come on. Observe. Have your own mind. Stop following with people. Stop being the sheep. Especially grown men, man. Stop being the sheep, man. All right. There's so many horror stories out there where men got played, they got taken for the money, and all that stuff. But y'all still pushing this, uh, it's more traditional women outside of America. No, it's women are women. It's just the same. Matter of fact, I'm going to do an interview with my Filipina. So she can tell y'all the real. If you don't believe me, you can talk to her. Not talk to her, but I'll I, I, I interview her. You feel me? Stop traveling to look for a woman. Travel to get some doggone culture. Travel, travel to get some new life. Travel to get some new experience. And if you happen to run across a good woman, that's fine. That's beautiful. And if you want to travel to find a woman, that's that's fine too. But make sure you vet and don't 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 just go directly into it and get married and all that shit, man. Vet. Take your time. You know what I'm saying? Because you might get with a gold digger. All right. There are even some women that will break up a home. It's been Filipinas that broke up another Filipino home that's with, that was with a Filipino. So don't think that the, the stuff don't go down over here in Southeast Asia. Over there in South America and in the islands. And Africa and in East Europe. Don't think that type of stuff don't go on. All right? Be smart. Stop following people. Use your smarts and use your brains. All right? And just know a lot of these people online, these dogs on content creators, have absolutely no integrity. And they're pimping you. Just like they tell you the Western women pimp you, they're pimping you too. All right? So that's about all I got to say, man. Use your mind. You're going to travel, travel. All right. Do you. But have your own mind. This is BG Aloysius up here in the Philippines. Man, y'all do one last thing for me. Y'all just keep on banking, man. Peace. Until next time, folks.